Today we have four absolutely scrumptious rackets to play test. <laughs> First one, uh, my returning favorite, Vocal V Field V1 Pro. So far, this is the lead candidate for my racket choice. Oh yeah. Um, I, what I like about it, it's it's got a nice weight to it. It's got a, I mean, it's it feels arm friendly. Uh, gets a lot of good power, and because I like to play on the baseline. Uh, what I liked about it last time was the trampoline like feel very plush but I don't know if that's the strings they were multi filaments so we brought it back a second time to verify that it was indeed the frame that was super enjoyable uh, curious to find out uh, next is the Yonex v -Core 100 Pro Stan the man stick of choice I picked it because it's got a similar weight to the vocal and I like the isometric head shape um, I'm just looking to see what Yonex can do for my game Indeed, I'm uh, very much looking forward to this isometric head shape and what it can do for me. Um, yeah, let's see if the one hand backhands come through. Supposedly, they're pure magic for that. Next, we have the head graphene 360 speed MP Pro. Or maybe it's just MP. Um, also, a similar weight class, all of these rackets. I like rackets around 11.2 11 11 11 to 11.5 strong. And this one has got some great reviews, and the Joker uses it, I think. So, looking forward to seeing what happens here. I think he uses an iteration of it. Uh, I'm not particularly yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, drawn one. to this, but hey, I'll give it a whirl. You know, the demo's here, so why not try it out? We'll see what it can do. Lastly, the Clash, the dark side. <laughs> Raving reviews online. Number one tennis racket for the last year in sales. Um, oh, yeah. It's got a real, it's a real bendy frame and apparently it stiffens up when you're swinging through it. So I'm just excited to see what this new technology feels like. Yeah, 100 square head, very much a tweener racket. Uh, definitely a good starting spot for the players that we are. So I think it'll treat us super well. Let's get out there. We're gonna play five sets and we're gonna pick apart some of the best points that we have for you guys with these rackets. <laughs> oh, jeez. That hurt. zip shellacking. Hey, we're playing next gen scores by the way so it's only to four. This clash awarded me uh, two aces and some incredible slice and also had a killer backhand. Uh, I don't know if it's this racket or if it's just me. I'm not sure if you Uh, first go, first game on the V feel. I'm liking it. Got a lot of good power, good connection. Backhand's a little weak, but that's more form than I prefer the thicker beam of the Clash to the thinner beam on this Yonex V-Core Pro. And the handle is a bit too small, but it's a demo, so they sent it, you know. But if I were to buy it, I would certainly go up a, a notch or two on the handle side.
That set ended a quick 4-1, and despite my increased performance with better rallies, I did feel, uh, I feel like that was more me getting warmed up than the racket. I hit the frame a fair amount, but overall, I liked it better than a lot of the rackets. I mean, like, good weights, good flop through. All I remember is, I stop waiting for your rescue.